Another uneventful scouting mission. I must say, I'm exhausted. I can't wait to roll into my cot. Ah, I think they're having a barbecue. What? Sound the alarms! The camp is on fire! They're all burning! Help! Assistance is required. I believe there is something wrong with me. Children. Parents, how are you alive? You both died in that chariot crash while on vacation six years ago. Well, if there's anything Sweetie Belle here has taught us, it's not to question things. Well, makes sense to me. I hope you like spending time with your biological sister because we're dumping her on you so we can vacation all week and watch the solar eclipse. The eclipse? Is that this week? As in Smooze will return and the end is nigh? Ugh, that's not Smooze. He's bigger. The fun levels will be at maximum efficiency. I shall acquire my yo-yo, hammer, and other objects of fun. So, when you say seven days, do you mean one whole week? And four weeks in a month. I'm so glad you took those classes. These are my spare mustaches. But I have so many preparations to make for the resurrection. Oh well, I guess play hammer toss with your sister will just have to be added to the ritual. Look, Rarity, I found more baggage. Vroom, vroom! Well, I certainly hope they have a fun vacation. Rarity, have I ever told you that I love you? Let's see. First, I have to see my therapist about my post-traumatic dress disorder. Then I have an acting workshop. I love you. Oh, uh, of course. I love you, too. Then I have to meet Fluttershy and prepare for the end of days. Rarity, I love you so much. Oh. Okay, why don't you ah, go out into the woods miles away from me and plant this tiny tree? Because life is worth protecting. When I'm feeling broken down, she has always got my back. <laughs> Something giant hat. Yes, I love my sister Rarity. There you are. See, I told you my compass always points to Sweetie Belle. What are you doing alone in the woods? Oh, I was just planting this tiny tree and pondering the fragility of life. Cool! Teach us? Well, we're not supposed to think about death, but okay. <gasps> this hat is marvelous! Oh, Sweetie Belle, you're back. Put this in the laboratory, won't you? Of course. I love you so much. Scanning. Scanning. Fabulous item located. Put out this tacky clothes line. I am displaying all of your fashion items. Hooray! You're displaying my magical one-of-a-kind amazing technicolor self-hugging sweater? The world isn't ready to know of its power. Did I make a mistake? And it's a one-time only use. Please don't tell me you activated it. Great. Now who shall hug me? Sweetie Belle. I think it's about time you took a bath. Now. Uh, but the water makes me feel funny. Make me a drawing, okay? Scanning. Arts and crafts located. Drawing. Drawing. Mmm. Insufficient beauty. I have arranged objects in an aesthetically pleasing manner. Did you use the dead raccoon I was keeping in this chest? Um, well, yes, but I know you have more in your workroom. But this carcass was the final component of my shrine! Do you know how long it took to tenderize this? Oops, an error has occurred. Sweetie Belle, you really need to be more self-aware of your surroundings. <gasps> This reminds me of a song I wrote. Just because you feel upset does not mean you have to yell. Stop that at once! Error. You know how I hate jumping. I love you. I love you. I love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you. Love you know, love little you. sister, you. you're love beginning you. to sound like a you. broken record. Now, why don't you go sing one of your silly songs and let me plot the apocalypse in peace? My primary function is failure. 
Fluttershy, I hate being late to our weekly Elmer's bath. The usual. I've almost finished the preparations for his return. Well, what about the raccoon? Oh, don't worry about that. On my way here, I found a dead one lying in the middle of the street, and I stashed it in my hat so that the gypsy couldn't use it for her portal. Pinky has a portal? I simply can't get enough of this smooth goo. When I don't get my weekly fix, I start to get anxious and shaky. I can see it now. When he returns, the world will be consumed by his ooze. What were you saying about the portal? Ooh, this is just like the real earthquake that'll bring about the smooth Nami. You've studied well. Now tell me about the portal. You know, since the world is ending, I really think I should do more for the cult. So then I thought, rather than 20%, I should donate all my money. Oh, no, I couldn't. No, I feel it is my obligation. You've done so much for me. But what about your sister? Please. Isn't that her college fund? Please. Well, I'd hate to be a bother, but if it means that much to you, of course I'll take your money. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. I promise you will not regret this decision. Now, if we miss the eclipse tomorrow, we'll have to wait another year. Don't worry. The one good thing about being in a war is that I can never forget. Wait, did I feed Sweetie Belle this morning? Howdy, Sweetie Belle. Want to eat paper with me? That dress looks fabulous. It does? I just wish there was a way to make Rarity see that we are both flesh and blood. <gasps> Applejack and I host it every year. It's a great way to get free labor on the farm. Yes, Rarity loves to jump up and down. The chances of success are 100%. Is literally the dumbest thing I've ever heard you say, you worthless pile of trash. Uh... Why would I spend an afternoon with a bunch of war criminals and their... war... crimes? Why not? Could it be because you are a robot? Don't joke about that! The robot police are always listening! And if you have nothing to fear, then why won't you join me? Ugh. A sister's contest? With you? If I wanted to be a loser, I would just join Twilight's softball team. I have so much strength inside of me that you don't even know what I could do. If the world isn't going to love me, then I'll teach it to fear me instead. Oh no, I'm so scared. What would you know about strength? You can't even walk down the stairs without tumbling forward like a slinky. Well, at least I don't spend every Veterans Day sobbing on the floor. I <gasps> bet you don't even have a war face. Rawr. Rawr. See? Mine's better. I'm leaving. Ow, 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 ow. War criminal? Well, ain't that just the butter calling the corn cob yellow? Rawr. Did I scare you? Gah. Wait. What war crime? It's not just your family. She thinks my hair's a war crime. Honey, Rarity thinks everything's a war crime. What war crime? The kind where Apple Bloom shuts her mouth and does as she's told. Sweetie Butter, just do your best to put up with Rarity until she dies. Sisters always do. But I'm always screwing things up. Apple Bloom screws things up all the time, and I just hide my disappointment. What's the worst he could have done? Incoming mortar! And she just kept screaming all day. Like, what's up with that? Don't you worry your ugly little head. Cause it's time for... Farm Labor! Apple Bloom, the grapes are different than our kind. You know what that means? Destroy! 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 You're making unstylish jelly? Aren't you afraid the fashion police will come and beat you with their fabulous batons? Nah, we can take them. Remember. Applejack, stop. The war was ten years ago. We don't need to have a breakdown. <laughs> Ow, to burn your whole village, you little muckraker. <laughs> Apple Bloom, don't let that she 
can share the spotlight. Get out of my way, sheep! Why have I seen these creatures in my dreams? Randy! Now that's how you stop a prison break. I've been falsely accused. Yeah. I wish my house had a fence. Drat, a few dragon scales short. If only we could kill Fluttershy's father again and get more. Maybe if I just use the raccoon corpse instead, no pony will notice. <gasps> Sister, my sister, I never appreciated you, and now you're gone! <laughs> and scene! After I wow the director with this monologue, I shall reclaim my sister! Or smooths! Sometimes I just stare into the flames and think about how small we all are. <gasps> Sweetie Belle! I've been rainbow dashing all over looking for you! Uh, Rump. <laughs> You do not fool me, Rarib, but as a robot, you are merely programmed to say that. Now, Sweetie Belle, if I were a robot, could I do this? Then how do you explain those acting classes? You clearly have difficulties expressing real emotions. Ha ha ha! You're sounding more and more like my therapist each day. Project, I am uninstalling you from my heart drive and reinstalling Applejack. Buy some apples! <laughs> Buy some Buy apples! Some apples. Applejack's my new sister, and she loves me no matter what. Hold on there, Wagon Wheel. Don't put words in my mouth. Your lack of bloodlust on the battlefield is proof positive that you are a soulless automaton. <gasps> I got soul, but I am not a soldier. Listen, I'll show you how to catch a hammer with your teeth, or the proper way to pose for headshots. Wouldn't that be fun? Look how fast I can run away. Can I go play on the tractor? Oh, can I play on the tractor too? I'm having a bad day. Apparently, there are several roles I don't get to play. <laughs> oh, Rarity. There ain't no instruction manual for being a good sister. It's something all sentient creatures feel deep in their souls. Being sisters is like a rattlesnake. You can have the head of a rattlesnake with its sharp teeth and curious tongue, or the tail of a rattlesnake with its mesmerizing rattle. But only together do you have a whole rattlesnake. And apart, all we are is just a screaming mess and a hollow object. <gasps> I have to go to the social. But what if I miss the resurrection? Ah, oh, the day of the social. The anniversary of Granny Smith's death. Life is such a fleeting yet precious thing. <laughs> What's going on? One lives one's death, one dies one's life. Look, it's the pig farm! This is where we harvest the blood to drop on ponies. Why is it funny to laugh at someone else's misery? Oh look, our characters are so malevolent and heartless. Maybe next we'll hear a new cheap catchphrase. Moonshine gravy! I hope you achieve maximum levels of fun. Initiating cry sequence. Gasp! that I could do the race with you, and we're only going to charge you twenty hundred dollars Success! <laughs> the race has begun. We must run fast, jump over the mud. Having a good time, where's Applejack? She fell in the mud. Are you okay? We can still win this jump in a bucket. That looked like it hurt. I know what pain is, it's great to be alive. But when I'm feeling weak, and when I'm feeling down, she is there to lift me up, lift me up over the spot. Yes, I love my sister, Applejack. Bum, bum, bum. Eating some pie, no time to chew. Pushing some hay, no time to lose. Pushing this hay really far. Pushing hay is really hard. Running in a circle, yes, having so much fun, hooray. Gotta chuck some grapes, throw them with your face. Sister, toss and squish and squash and making tacky jelly. Put it on your head, we're gonna win the race. Because I am a good racer, I am running oh so fast. Fun levels are to the max. Applejack flies through the air, apples fall without a care. Apples are not meant to fly, no apples get left behind. When small things get kicked around, they just might destroy the town. Broken down, she has always got my back. Life is worth protecting now. Place it in that giant hat. Yes, I love my sister Applejack. Now we're racing toward the finish.
finish line Nothing matters once you die But we're along for the ride And you sacrifice the meaning Just to have the words rhyme In the end it all comes down To just how far we can slide Why don't you cross the sentient scanner? It's only a few more feet it no longer matters to me whether my sister is a robot because she is my real sister all the same. Set phasers to hog. What? So, you're the best sister ever and a shapeshifter? No, it's rarity. But during the race, I was wearing my magical Applejack contact lenses. They changed everything but her eyes. You all deceived me. Mm -hmm. Initiate happy cry sequence. Cry? That's not a war face. I love you. You see, we are a rattlesnake. You may have missed the eclipse, but I felt it was imperative that I save your soul. Together, we can start planning for next year. Yay! Yes, but where? The spa, of course. <laughs> For whatever reason, Celestia wants us to send letters now, so what did we learn? It's a good thing that earlier I swallowed that microtape from Twilight. Dear Princess Celestia, Today, in a separate adventure at the Brohoof Bash, I learned the importance of loving your brother, even if you don't always get along. Your faithful student, Twilight Sparkle. Hello? Is this thing on? Okay. My name's Spike the Dragon, and this is my audition for the Heartswarming Eve pageant. <clears throat> Here we go. Look at me! I will never pass for a perfect bride! Or a perfect daughter! Can it be? I'm not meant to play this part! Who is that girl I Staring straight back at me When will my reflection show Who I am inside? Oh, please don't tell Twilight She said I was forbidden to dream But it'll all be okay Because we're friends and I can trust you guys with my secret Right no. now! <laughs> <laughs>